Hi everybody, we've come back to Diana and Genova with Crow. It's been well reacted to, well received, but I'm going to give you my interpretation after we watch the video. And remember everybody that's new to my channel, I always give my interpretation of the lyrics. That can be completely different, but at the same time I try and keep as close to I can. So Diana fans don't go, no, that's not what she said on her fan page, no. Every single song is open to interpretation. And it's my interpretation on my channel I give of songs. That's what my channel is about. Bit of bio, my interpretation, and you enjoying a different perspective. So now that we've oh, understand that, I can only say her musical links for this is in the description attached to my video. It is in over 32 languages because we need to save her. I've been looking at the images and I recently did two Diana videos together. So check them out um, on my channel. And please like, comment and subscribe and tell me what you think of this song. This is her live version at the DA presentation back in 2021. And she's up on stage and she talks about it and then she sings the song. I'm looking forward to seeing all of it. I have spent some time translating the Russian into English. I have my own translated English in front of me from Russian. There you go. I'm very dedicated to Diana and her fans. And attached to this is a Dimash video. Don't forget to support him if you're from Russia because it's an excellent video. Which one is it? Well, you have to check out my playlist. And the only way you can do that is subscribe. Take it away, Diana. I'm looking forward to the full performance of this. Предложила ее я, кстати, чтобы исполнить проект. А, наверное, поэтому она так мне подошла. Никто лучше тебя не знает, что тебе нужно. Песня Ворона. Yeah, but 
Bravo is right, Diana. Absolutely sensational. The great thing about your voice is straight away I noticed Urenka, which is one of the earliest reactions I did to your music. And it's on my channel, everybody. Do look out for that because I give a very inter uh, good interpretation of my, my feelings towards the lyrics and just listening to that vocal range. And you did it again. It's just, you've got something incredibly, incredible, uniquely unique, and it's, your vocals are liquid gold, and you're just everything. And if you mix it, if it was a cake, it would be the most delicious cake to eat. Because when your ears hear your voice music, and it goes down, it goes past the heart into the soul. That's how you feel every time. That's why I keep reacting to you, young lady. You're absolutely phenomenal. Now it's your turn for the lyrics i'm going to bring up okay what i did today for the translation it says tic tac tic tac singing of a volcano rivers stop they don't drink water anymore you like them but i am like the crow so it's almost saying straight away to me that she's her emotions are becoming tested she's in a, a place where it could be anything around her it doesn't have to be a person but she's being tested and she feels that when when people refer to waters running dry water is that's how we live our bodies are made up of i think over 90 percent water even more and we depend on water for substance for living for breathing for being here for our existence and if your emotions are like the river and they dry up and you're feeling tension like a volcano oof, something's happening and then she says you like them so the other person's emotions are drying up and she's feeling ready to boil here and get angry but i'm like the crow she resolves in saying now the crow is considered dark and mystical some people fear it other people adore it but she's like the spirit of the crow she's she'll hide her feelings until she decides to explode like a volcano they continue don't they don't shatter windows there are none left straight away in verse two that that means the amount of times that she has screamed or been angry at things or just let rid of frustration it's almost symbolic when she says the windows have shattered just the amount of time she's felt just frustrated in life whether it be with this relationship or whether it be with life that's the position she's opening verse two with and she says fairy tales speak of sunlit place but i sing where the crow sings and we do live on fairy tales when we're grown up we believe i always like millions of boys around the world i said i'm going to be either a tennis player or a fireman and my father's face was just and then i said mm, okay if you don't like that maybe i'll be something else but we all believe in fairy tales that's the point but she says where she sings where her heart beats where she just is where the crow sings and then she repeats herself vocally she goes into vocals in the song four times she repeats nay 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 the, it wasn't the chorus but it was just almost like the sound of a crow crowing so we continue somebody takes a shot aiming to scare but i sit and i won't stand i'm not like them i'm like the crow how many people and farmers and everybody goes out and they shoot crows because of the myth 
when my mother saw a crow crossing uh, skipping along the road my mother used to bless herself there's all these myths and legends about crows but she's saying and people always have a shot at them and always try to to destroy them but she says she won't sit in life she'll stand tall and I'm not like them I'm like the crow I'll avoid the bullets I'll avoid um, everything that's thrown at me I'll be dark and mystical and just appear when you least expect me so the chorus is I'm a crow I'm a crow and that's when she comes and she resonates as a crow in her vocals in the technique that Diana has and you know I'm a crow emphasizing I'm a crow her spirit her way of being flying high in the sky people weary of you she's at that in this song she's at that point of life where it's just everything around her Keep your distance be afraid of me and if you're not you should be i'm legendary in my own right and she goes no 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 but as she flies around spiritually feeling she's releasing through this through something she adores then it says ticking as volcanoes sing so she's ready to erupt rivers standing still so everything isn't running dry now it's she's reversing everything at the moment here she said drinking water no more so she won't let the other person drink her emotions drink her love drink she's now there's the water but it stands still i'm putting on hold how i feel how i think until i'm in a place of happiness she keeps saying you're like them but i'm like the crow and then she goes back to the vocals nee 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 na 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 now she finishes with the with the on the outro chorus with I'm a crow emphasizing I'm a crow and combines it with the vocals Nina Nina because what she's doing is she's symbolizing to the world there's a dark side to her there's a mysterious side to her and it's one of mystique and even she is trying to understand the world find her place do things and it's like the pandora box but if she spiritually was to be asked how do you see yourself she mentions the crow because people it, it's almost like one of those things you either love them or hate them and she's saying you decide but you're like them you're like all the others when you see a dark side to me when you see somebody who reacts when you see you, you you can't handle it but that's like people's reactions to the crow they can either handle them or they cannot and that's my interpretation of the crow by diana and kachanova thank you for listening i hope you press those buttony things like subscribe and please comment Come on, I need more subscribers. It's a growing channel, but I need you as well, Diana fans. 